America has just about the highest incarceration rate of any nation on Earth. And one way to start reducing the number of people that we have in prison is for governors across the country to more aggressively start using their pardon power. In most states, governors can issue clemency or pardons or do it with a parole board's uh, approval. Generally, however, the politics of that decision are terrifying for governors who don't want to be attacked for being soft on crime. The end result is that they vastly underuse their ability to pardon folks. So now comes along the strange case of Matt Bevin. He's the former Kentucky governor who almost seems to have gone about his mass pardons and commutations in a way designed to produce the worst kind of discrediting of the project. After losing his re-election bid last month, Bevin spent his lame duck weeks pardoning more than 600 people. What made these clemency moves so controversial was the lack of public stated rationale from the outgoing governor. That, and at least one of the convicted murderers pardoned by the, was the brother of a man who had helped a campaign fundraiser for Bevin. Something that sparked the attention of the FBI, according to Louisville's Courier Journal. And everything Bevin has done to defend his decisions has been, frankly, a PR disaster, including this when he was asked during a radio interview about a child rapist whose sentence he pardoned. These girls both were examined medically. They were examined physically. There was zero evidence, zero. Both their hymens were intact. This is perhaps more specific than people would want. But trust me, if you have been repeatedly sexually violated as a small child by an adult, there are going to be repercussions of that physically and medically. There was zero evidence of that. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.